Orange, you glad I didn't say banana? <laughs> You've got two on sticks. You don't need any more fatty. <laughs> you're famished. Look at you, you fat fuck. Fucking hundred, Jesus Christ. Do we have a hundred? No, we don't. Fuck. We don't. I used them all. Oh, oh, more. I used them all to buy nutrients. I'm sorry, Jay. Wait, I have to spin and then kick him. That's how we get started. Right. Oh, we're almost there. Yeah, it's a team oh, effort. Oh yeah, baby, you got me right there. Mm. It was a team effort. I, 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 what, fucking why? Stop! 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 It's not working. Stop it. So apparently, I'm the only one who. Okay, that's retarded. <laughs> so we don't have enough now. I told you to stop, and you wouldn't fucking stop. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. God damn it. We'll have those extra star bits in no time. <laughs> I, it's not really your fault. It's the game being a shithead. But... Why are they so mean to me? I said it wasn't your fucking fault. You yelled at me? Yeah, because you didn't stop. I need you to stop. It's like, oh, do I need to keep going? <laughs> I, I can't help being re re retarded. <laughs> I put pictures on the internet and it said I look ripped. <laughs> but it didn't look ripped and said I look oh, fucking fat. Terrible. Oh. <laughs> there we are. Two. <laughs> fucking hell. God damn, that thing is fat. That's. You better like, turn into a go kart. <laughs> that is like, not a go kart. Why? Why would it give you, like, the option to, like,. Uh, shoot the star bits if you can't actually do the main thing that you're supposed to shoot yeah, star really bits Yeah, there's really no for. point me having this remote. Yeah, pretty much. This is this is why I opted for... Oh, Jake, like, I may have to try turn the remote off. I don't know if it will. Uh, just... Well, I, I can't remember if it's just... I didn't want it popping up on the screen. Yeah. Yeah, it's been a while since I played the fucking Wii, so I can't remember if a uh, thing goes on saying it's like, oh, if I got we just have to give up the second controller. No more me. Well, I did say, like, do, did you want to play? Nah, I'm, I'm still good. I'm good watching. You seem to be doing this a lot quicker than if I would play. I would just get bored and run around in a circle for like 15 minutes. Yeah. So really, basically what I do in life. Yeah. I forget what I'm doing and just run around in a circle for like 15 minutes. <laughs> Damn, son. And that was the yeah. time that Mario got so high. Really, is a whole galaxy. I thought it was just you went to a planet. No, it's... you go to a different planet for each different mission, not a different galaxy. No, it's well. There's a reason why it's called Super Mario Galaxy. Because it's well, fucking I galaxy, it was galaxy and shit. not galaxies. I'm assuming that's the plural. Yeah, probably not. Fucking that. Galaxi. <laughs> Galaxus. Galaxis. I don't fucking know. Destroy, destroy yeah. a poon. Yeah, that sounds like a very, very shitty, like, uh, Marvel villain. Galaxis. I am Galaxis. Destroyer of poon. Why, like, don't villains usually have, like, a name that somewhat got to do with... <laughs> no, no, he's just Galaxis Destroyer of poon. That's him. Oh, that fucking reminds me. Um, uh... <laughs> there's, there's an episode of Teen Titans Go coming out uh, soon, and like, talk about fucking mismatched fucking voice actors. Like, you know, like, you're a DC person. I am. Right? You know Darkseid, or is it Darkseid? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, Darkseid, yeah. Fucking Teen Titans Go has Weird Al Yankovic voicing Darkseid. Dark really? Yeah. <laughs> That's awesome. <laughs> Very out of place, but kind of It's cool. incredibly fucking out of place. And the weird thing is... Is like uh, the character. Uh, I think Cyborg remarks like, "You sound familiar. Who do you sound like?" I got it. You sound like Weird Al Yankovic. <laughs> and fucking Dark Side's like, "Yes, the most evil man on earth." Uh, I really can't like, stand Teen Titans yeah. Go. I know it is so bad. It's like, yes, yeah, Weird Al, the most evil man on earth. He 
takes people's own works of art and ridicules them as his own works of art. <laughs> And gets paid for it. It's the most evil genius thing in the universe. That's pretty genius. <laughs> yeah. If only I could make money stealing someone else's hard work. It's... I could be the next Bill Gates. Or Steve Jobs. Well, he doesn't steal it. It's like... You can, he, he can legally do it under like uh, fair use. That and he actually like asks the artist if he can do that or not. You can legally have sex with a rhinoceros. It doesn't mean that it is the way to go of your life. So? If it's legal, it's legal. <laughs> oh, when in a European care. country that allows you to do so. <laughs> Who gives a fuck? I can't remember the specific countries in the world that still allow you to have sex with animals. Not that that's something that's common knowledge and that I would even know. Yeah, I, I think I, yeah. I think I actually saw like uh, something about like America having more states that's like legal to have sex with animals than there is like states that's legal for gay marriage or some shit. I don't think that's true. Because yeah, I don't think there's just... any states in America that is legal to have sex with an animal. <laughs> it's it was more European countries. Like I want to say Amsterdam. This is a place where it's actually still legal, but I, I might be wrong about that. You know, I think it was Netherlands. Like, I don't know. Yeah. There's a, a weird documentary I remember seeing on that all, all that chestnut on it. This is, this is some keen topic for Mario Galaxy. Yeah, people fucking animals. Oh, I must say, Mario is looking pretty fly in his bee costume. <laughs> no pun intended. Why? Because. Shut up. No, I'm busy making jokes. I hate you so much right now. Jake, your <laughs> words sting. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off. Uh, you and your puns, god damn it. Play I'm sorry, I'm just combing for all the good ones. <laughs> Honeycombing <laughs> God damn it. Uh, oh god. I think I'm actually out of bee hunt. I don't know a lot about bees. Oh god, I miss other than, you. Other than, you fucked off to Africa. Other than what I've learnt from that movie with Jerry Seinfeld in it. <laughs> What's the deal with, with bees? bees? We always walk in a straight line, <laughs> and we make lots of honey. <laughs> what the deal with fucking a Mexican chick? <laughs> <laughs> what was that from again? Um, I believe it was a hot DD demon. Uh, oh yeah, that's uh, right. Yeah, where he made this very depressing like video that was. Oh just, yeah, his this uh, guy Jerry going through day in day out yeah. of just like living his life and all this shit happening. To and him. then was horrible. And then he did a remaster, remaster, a remaster where he gave Jerry a voice and it was fucking Jerry Seinfeld. <laughs> <laughs> what is the deal with fucking a Mexican chick? What's the deal with staring at the moon? I mean, it's cold outside. <laughs> 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 oh fucking hell. Okay, this, this bee wants you to give her a rub down. Yeah, yeah. Not that I know this already. <laughs> yeah. Not that we played this before recording. Yeah, not that I used this level to fucking... Or this joke. Yeah. The same joke that I just used. You wanna get in there, Jake? Yeah. Learn all the areas that the right way to rub a queen woman. Get in there nice and deep, like. Tushy tush. The, tushy tush. the left eye. The back. Your hair. The lower back. <laughs> and of course, the a-hole. <laughs> the common stimuli among bee women. <laughs> if ever need to go to Amsterdam to fuck a bee. Amsterdam of all things. It's like, oh yeah, that's what they're known for. It's like, uh... <laughs> bee fucking. Yeah, legalized weed and bee fucking. <laughs> You go get yeah, you weed brownies. Go fuck a bee. <laughs> it's it's kind of like novelty things like when you go to countries and they can like write your name on a grain of salt. Yeah, 
If I can get down this shit. Sorry, a grain of rice. <laughs> yeah. It's very more impressive when they write it on a grain, grain of, of salt. salt. Yeah. So yeah, this is the uh, the uh, minor the, toad thing. Yeah, the first appearance of Captain Toad. Yeah. What does he do? What's his what is his what's his stick? Fucking nothing. He's just a toad which wears a, a mining cap. Yep. And they made a game out of him. Like fucking six years later, I think. And no one bought it. <laughs> Ever. Yeah, no one really cared for Captain Toad. It's like it was a cool little mini game for that game, but why buy a game that's just that? Especially when it's like eighty bucks. Oh yeah, fuck it. It's that. a full price game, it's not a mini game price. Yeah, yeah. Nintendo seemed to make a common mistake of turning mini games into full games and expecting us still to pay a full game price yeah, for it. Yeah, yeah. Like, imagine if they just made, like, a Pono riding a game and called it Link's Crossbow for Training. Oh, wait. <laughs> and sold it with the Wii Zapper. Yeah. Not to be confused with the Frank Zapper. <laughs> Well, look, Captain Toad, you need to make a spaceship to get to NASA. That light is just shining directly in his face. <laughs> yeah. I can't see my cataracts! My cataracts! <laughs> That's like a light that you use for fucking caves and shit. <laughs> look how bright it is in the yeah. light. It's actually made a solid coat of yeah, light. <laughs> it's just pure negative light and it's just oh. shining right in his eyes. Jesus Christ. Poor Mario has just burnt <laughs> every part of his <laughs> <My> eyes! <laughs> it's just black and just gone back in. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, fucking hell. Fucking hell. So you want to be a Mario boy? <laughs> fucking hell. I think with later Mario games, they made them way too easy. And I think this was yeah, the start yeah. of this de the decline. Because it was ever since this game, they started being really easy. Well, to be fair, the and later lives, lives were so just so hard, oh, so easy to get. Yeah. Like, finishing New Super Mario Bros. with, like, over hundreds of lives is just ridiculous. Yeah, yeah. Because I never lost one. Yeah, like, later on in the game, there's, like, much, much harder levels, but, um... But even if you die, it does it for you, the levels. You can collect a thing and it, and it basically lets you just fly over half the level. Oh, uh, not in this game. Oh, it, it, like a new Super Mario uh, like yeah. later ones that lets you do that. Yeah, but this one is still, like, you know, a game. <laughs> it's still a game. Yeah. I'm not a big, big fan of, like, Super Mario 64 and... Yeah, Kind of like design. roam around and grab thing games, I like to call them. I don't know if there's like, actually a correct title for those kind of genre of games like Banjo Kazooie. Uh, I think they were just something. called like action platformers or some shit. There's not really much action. They're yeah, more I just, know. They're more for the OCD. Yeah, so there's like more platform. Like, yeah, I wasn't like really too big on those kinds of games either, unless they're on the PlayStation. I mean, Conker's had enough like humor in it to keep me entertained. That the collecting things wasn't that big of a task because mm. I just wanted to get to the next level. I wanted to see what was the next thing. Yeah. You know? But when it came to Banjo-Kazooie it's just like, oh, you got to collect this many uh, yeah, nuts yeah. and bolts. Like, and this many everyone fucking pieces. loves Banjo-Kazooie and I, I can see why. It's just, it was one I of those games. I can't see why. It was one of those games that like I played a lot but never actually finished because like, I'd get halfway through it's like, uh, it's just more of the same. It gets to a point and it's just like, you need a hundred jigsaw puzzle pieces. And you're like, oh yeah. shit, I've only got 50. Time to go grind some more. And it's not like RBG grinding where you can yeah, do it in yeah. like the room five minutes away from the boss. Yeah, Less so of that... golden sun. Oh, RPGs. this boss is... Yeah, the final boss is pretty hard, but it'll be a lot easier if you collect like almost everything in the game. Like, oh, yay. Thank yeah. you. Oh, oh, give me that shit. Give me that shit. Oh, damn. Mm. Yeah, eat shit, nigga. Oh, baby, a triple. <laughs> Fuck off. 